let's talk about how to use a cestoscope. So first off, one of the biggest things is these earpieces. These earpieces slant slightly to one direction. We wanna make sure those slant toward or forward into our ear canal. If they slant backwards into our ear canal, then they're gonna hit the back of our ear canal and we're not gonna hear anything. But if they slant forward into our ear canal, we will hear things. So of course we always make sure of that. The next thing is our diaphragm. This is the diaphragm right here. We want to very lightly tap the diaphragm, lightly, because otherwise you're going to deafen yourself. <laughs> so please don't do that. So very lightly, we tap the diaphragm. If we don't hear anything, we want to twist this holding very tightly here. Just twist, tap again to make sure you hear something. I already heard it on this side, but twist, I don't hear anything on this side. Twist, I hear it on this side. So then I know that I'm hearing through this side of the diaphragm. Now we're ready to listen to the heart. So on a dog, also on a cat, we can find the heart just behind the elbow in our armpit region. So we can find it two ways. We can go just in the armpit region right here and if you're not hearing it right away, just go deeper into the armpit. Some dogs have a lot of skin in that area. So you just kind of have to push into that area. The other way is coming from the front. Now don't go right here. You're not gonna hear it. That's just their sternum area, their chest bone. You wanna go into the same area just coming from the front. So you can see my hand from this area. You're still going into the armpit. You're just coming from the front if the dog would prefer that. And that's how you listen to their heart using a stethoscope.